Hey guys, it's been a little while since I checked in by video. It's good to be back. Well, back in Stratford that is. Of course I already mentioned in um, one of my posts there on RaymondJohnstone.com and for any of you that are new to RaymondJohnstone.com just checking it out for the first time um, welcome I'm happy to have you glad you were willing to give a little bit of your busy day to checking out whatever it is that I'm doing who knows really um, wanted to mention a couple updates to the website um, some cool stuff so I've been, as I've mentioned a couple times, uh, probably not very much in depth, but I've been following um, a number of different cryptocurrencies online that are of interest to me, and I've put tickers. So basically what you think of as a stock ticker, you know, uh, that gives you minute to minute updates on the current pricing of, of whatever that stock is. Well, I've put five different tickers up onto uh, the website, onto RaymondJohnstone.com, that give you the price of Bitcoin, Litecoin, Ethereum, um, and the last one that is, is new to me, actually, or sorry, Ethercoin, um, the last one that I'm checking out that is new to me, just a recent interest, is actually intertwining the blockchain with uh, artificial intelligence. It's a platform that a single gentleman so far is developing, but I imagine others will take up the, take up the flag as well, and that, that one is called Sapience. So all of those are very interesting to me, and you can find up-to-date price um, into Canadian currency on RaymondJohnstone.com um, slash faucet so please feel free to check that out and the other exciting thing as I just mentioned slash faucet I now have a Litecoin faucet running on RaymondJohnstone.com as well so for any of you that are new to cryptocurrencies um, a common practice to 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 share distribution just because well the fact is that there's actually you know it completely contrary to what everyone would have us believe or at least a lot of people believe uh, there's actually a lot of money out there so what the faucet is is it's a place where you can go and get a little bit of free litecoin so yeah, I run a Litecoin faucet at RaymondJohnstone.com slash faucet. And please feel free to check that out as well. I do, please have some patience. I do need to put some funds in there. So as soon as I do, that will be live. And if any of you are feeling you know, generous and feel like putting a few Litecoins in there, please feel free to do so as well. Obviously the address is available on that site, on that page. So those are my updates for now in terms of the website. I wanted to talk a little bit further about um, why I canceled. I don't even know if I actually canceled my trip west and south or if I'm really undecided. I'm, I'm, my head's up in the clouds about it at the moment, but um, for the moment I am back in Stratford. I'm roofing actually. I'm doing some roofing with Highlander Roofing, if any of you need uh, a roof done in Ontario, you know, Canada, Ontario, then please feel free to Google us. <laughs> you know, I've got to plug my own company for a little bit, of course. Apologize. Um, and the reason that I came back to Stratford is, first of all, I realized that the community that I was leaving here in Stratford is it's its something that I really haven't I, I don't want to say that I haven't had it anywhere else but I don't feel like I've had it I don't feel like I've set roots as deep anywhere else as I have here in Stratford and that was really a realization that I came to while I was on the road while I was pedaling and 
it felt really good to to come to that realization just just to hear the resolution in in my own you know in the energy in my own not even thoughts but in my own heartfelt in my own emotions in my in, in my you know in my being that that I have that type of connection to community and on top of that really um, not not to say that it was silly or anything like that because I still do believe that learning more about how communities go about forming and how they go about forming around food and how they go about forming in any way whatsoever is something that very much interests me and I will continue to research that and and discuss those topics talking about you know collaborative commons and and what that term even means and on a further note talking about how maybe the collaborative commons and and this cryptocurrency world that we're seeing emerge may actually be very complementary to each other so that's what I have to say today I hope life finds you beautiful and is treating you well, or yeah, I think life is treating me very well as, and is very beautiful for me as well. So, Raymond Johnstone, signing off.